God cannot stand a mixture. Either you're living in the light or you're dwelling in the darkness. Either you're a child of God or your daddy is the devil. There is no middle ground. Religion doesn't change anyone, Jesus changes. Religion doesn't heal anyone, Jesus is the healer. To this day, I have the evidence of the hand of God in my throat. Come on, come and receive your deliverance. Repent and renounce and worship the Lord in this place. Hallelujah. <laughs> Just receive that joy. But the scripture says there's a joy unspeakable. <laughs> I was seeing just blur up here and then I came out for prayer and then I can see everybody, I can see you all down there clearly. <laughs> I was addicted to cocaine and um, cigarettes, alcohol. I came here hungover to this tent revival and the enemy was trying to say, you can't go. I was, had condemnation bad and I was saying, Lord, please, like, I need to just get out and I came here, second night deliverance broke out. I was set free from addiction, anger, lust, all these things, wow. they're gone, so. Hallelujah. Yeah, so we've got the there. cigarettes Hallelujah. and the lighter. Amen. Amen. I had a bladder problem. When I was paying, I felt all of this. I've not had a bladder problem since. Wow. So I'm here tonight to declare that Jesus has restored my right eye, that I couldn't see anything out of it. And now I'm seeing the lights over there. Oh, come on! Give Jesus a shot! Oh, honestly, I couldn't do that. I couldn't even... When I'm going up my stairs, I have to hold onto the railings because it was so painful. To... Do what you couldn't do before. Show me. Show these sceptics. Come on! She couldn't walk she like that. She was walking on a crutch and she couldn't walk at all. She had pain in both legs. Just how long were you suffering from this? Over 20 years. Over 20 she... years! Over 20 years! Open. Not Jesus. the Antichrist is open. And look. And you couldn't do that before? I couldn't do that before for five years. Diagnosed with lumbar stenosis and fasciitis all over my legs. And I, I couldn't run for five years. I want you to walk down those steps and I want you to run across this field right now. God is looking for a people who are willing to lay it down. That whatever it is, Lord, that my life is not my own, Lord. I, I want all of you, Lord. I only want what you have for me. We need to get into a place where we're so hungry for God, where there is no plan B, there is no plan C. It's like, God, I'm either in all with you or it's nothing else. I want to see it all. Let the train of your road fill this temple, God. The train of your road fill this temple, God. Yes, you are holy. Yes, you are holy. I believe in my heart and I confess with my mouth. You are something's in the heart and you've never felt it before. Something's in your heart and you've never felt it before. Some of you may not be used to atmospheres like this because all you've had is religion and church services that are spiritually dead. But it's in atmospheres like this that God moves, His Spirit touches lives. And it's time for us to get used to it. 